Hey guys, what's going on? It's your favorite cancer causing appliance microwave here. And for today's video, I'm gonna show you how to successfully defend the site bedroom and commander's office on the second floor with Amira on the new map fortress. Now, if you are playing with a buddy or you have a whole squad, make sure you at least grab castle or legion because it's going to help amplify your defenses dramatically. Also, if you enjoy this type of content, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe because I'm gonna be breaking down each single site just for you, the viewer. First thing you would do is grab Mira and make sure you have the secondary weapon as the shotgun. This is going to allow you to open up some of these sweet lines of sights that I'm gonna show you here in a second. So the first thing you're gonna do is, well, this is the bedroom and this is the commander's office. These are the two sites you're gonna be defending. The first thing you're going to do is run inside the bathroom and reinforce this hatch right here. The reason behind this is because the attackers will most likely try to go from below and remove the mirrors. And this hatch is the only way to do that. See this floor right here is not breachable at all. So now if you've played on maps such as Border, there's a site called Armory, which is the main defense site. Generally, people will go to the front door, Zofia the bottom or Bucket, and then they just remove the mirror from the equation altogether. Then a thermite will open up the wall and plant, and then it's GG. Well, here in the bathroom, they can't really do that. Again, because there's no way to get it. So you're going to put a mirror on the far right side facing the west part of the map. And I'll show you why I do everything here in a second. You're going to go ahead and open this up like so. Remove those pesky studs. And then you're going to open up this side right here. Now, you're not going to open it all the way up because there's really no reason to. And it's going to give them a uh, sight over here, which I'll explain why here in a second. So this mirror is essentially to watch the whole west side just from this little location. And you're safe. You're kind of safe, except for that door. I'll explain it here in a second. But yeah, so you're going to watch this door, this window, this window right here, and then this entryway. Now... If you think somebody is peeking this into sight, you can actually throw a C4 like so, go, and you could deny them an easy kill. All right, so you might be like, microwave, can't they just shoot this canister from that door? Let me go outside and show you real quick. All right, here we are. I'm the attacker. All right, can't shoot it. You can't see it. It's not there. You can't see the canister at all. It's blocked by this pole. Perfect positioning. They might be like, microwave, but they can just shoot you, right? Huh? They can just shoot you, and that's true. But that's why you have a castle, or lesions, or barbed wire, or something here, preferably barbed wire lesions, to kind of let you know, hey, somebody's over here. It gives you that audio cue of uh, alerting you. And then you also have the camera here to let you know. You can also have Valkyrie cams. Basically, you're just there to watch the west side and kind of watch your back. You're there to watch this whole area so it's a really good mirror and there's no way to counter it unless they rush inside you know there's no barbed wire there's no elamines they just rush inside like this nobody's watching it then they can get it otherwise it's a perfectly placed mirror now let me show you what it looks like as an attacker so let's say an attacker comes up over here there's that door there's all that barbed wire there's that castle uh, they're not want to they're not gonna want to go over there They're gonna want to try to come over here or they might come from the outside this balcony you have entered an enemy controlled area. This is that angle that I was talking about Let me go and pick this up because I don't want no beepy beeps in my video Okay, now that's why you don't open it up all the way because otherwise they're able to you know Shoot all the way in sight and again if you hear them here from that mirror Just go ahead and throw a c4 toss it into them get them easy win make it a 5v4 pretty quick So but if they if they overextend here you're there to punish them. Also, this horse right here. That's a goat sound. What does the horse make? There, there we go. Yeah, the horse here. That was cringy. Oh, well. Uh, the horse is going to block the shot. I don't, should I cut that out? I don't know. All right. Here's another window from the balcony. This is the same area as that door I was just in, which is right there. there you're able to stop them if they jump in with that mirror that I showed you. Now, I need somebody, or you'll need somebody to reinforce this wall right here. Otherwise, they're able to just shoot inside. So you need a reinforcement here, and you need a reinforcement here. Fun fact, if you reinforce from the outside, it's going to be a lot easier for somebody to see a Maverick from the inside. Otherwise, if somebody reinforces the from the inside, you'll see it's all black right here, right? It makes it a lot harder to see the Maverick hole on the reinforcement side 
than the wood side. So try to reinforce all your stuff from the outside. So you're going to have one here and one here. Now, again, that mirror watches this door. The only way into sight into this A site, which is the commander's office, is through this door. That's it. Unless they breach this wall or this wall. Okay. So you need a reinforcement here and you need a reinforcement here. So that's four reinforcements your team needs to make. So it's super easy to set up. Now, again, this mirror blocks this door. If they come up over here, they can't get into sight at all. Now, if they come over here, this is where I was telling you earlier that they can open it up. But, but I have a mirror just for that. And let me show you here. Let me go all the way around to kind of show you what I'm going to be doing. So you're going to be putting a mirror on the far right side, or at least as close as possible. This is going to be facing inside the bedroom, the B site. All right. So you're going to open this up like so. Open it up. Boop, boop. Might take a second. But we'll get there. All right. This should be looking pretty good. We're almost there. You don't want to remove all the wood on top. I'll show you why here in a second. Because they, they kind of patched something. So let me show you. This might be kind of annoying, but it's going to save you in the long run. If you, if you could do this with the shotgun perfectly, more power to you. Otherwise, let me just show you something. So... Ubisoft made it to where you need the wood to trigger the animation for vault, right? Otherwise, so you, you can't you can't jump on the metal part. You need the piece of wood to be able to vault over. See? Like so. Otherwise, you can't get over that. Now you can jump into sight without that piece of wood, and I'll show you here in a second, but you need this this little strip of wood to actually utilize that that vault animation let me show you so boom remove it no more wood it's all gone right you could jump in but you can't jump out see you can't you can't get out it's done so that's why if you can try to get it perfectly positioned to where the wood beam is right across that that metal beam right here otherwise you'll have to jump over this metal piece now that's why i did did it like that now let me show you why you have this mirror here it's essentially to defend the b site kind of watch the um, the back of the other mirror. So you're able to watch the stairs. You'll reinforce this, obviously. Now, you can't open it, but it creates a really weird situation. I'm trying to jump over here. Ah, can't do it! All right, so you can open this up, but it kind of makes it more difficult. If you lose this mirror for any reason, they're able to just, like, peek the sight, and it's just not good. So I recommend going to reinforce this but you can keep it open it's up to you the choice is yours but i recommend close it so you need one reinforcement two three and then four five and then six seven because we all know that there's a jaeger or a vigil or somebody that will immediately just run away from sight and try to get a spawn kill instead of help you so this requires minimal setup you can actually just get away with you know five if you want but um this is what i recommend so yeah this is my setup for Mira. It's worked against uh, really high level players. I tried testing out with some pro players earlier last night and it worked out really well. You'll probably see this actually in the pro league, but I wanna go ahead and show you guys, the viewers first. The other Mira is an okay Mira. It's, it's not too great, but this Mira setup right here will definitely win you some games. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you want to see me do more of these videos. Um, I do have another video called How to Counter Every Mirror on Every Site that was um, a few months old. Shut up! i trying to do my outro. Um, that was a few months old. I'll put a link in the description. It shows you how to actually counter pretty much every well-known meta site Mira for you. Uh, but yeah, I appreciate you hanging out with me. And with that... Make sure you guys hug your loved ones, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, bye. We made it to 10 minutes. Yes. All friendlies were eliminated.